So, the DCU, people are calling um, DC now. Now, people were calling Marvel their MCU because, well, it was the MCU, and they were supposedly killing off all the male characters and replacing them with female characters. I'm like, oh, God. Um, can't we have both? Can't we have the female characters and the male characters? Do we have to kill off the male characters so the female characters can... Um, isn't, isn't, aren't there enough villains for both of them? I just never understood why they wanted to do that. Um, and were they really doing that? Was that just a bunch of hater rumours and that? Or it looks like they're doing it. I mean, we've got Lady Four. Um, we've got Captain Marvel. Um, Miss Marvel. Who else do we have? Um, I've never, I never knew who Riri, um, whatever was, who's supposed to be the female Iron Man. Uh, he, she's going to do something. I think, was there a She-Hulk? I don't, know, I don't know what's happening with Marvel or DC right now. Um, I know Black Widow got, finally got her own film, even though she's dead. Um, finally got some Asian um, superheroes. I know we did have one once upon a time, but um, now we have more. Um, yeah. I don't know. I hear that um, they are killing Superman. Um, apparently Zod is going to kill Superman when he's a child, so we never have Superman. Um, that's the way to get rid of Henry Cavill. Um, I hear that Batman is killed as a child and his parents become Batman and the Joker, and that's something that was apparently set up in, um, um, Zack Snyder's, um, God, what was it, what was the name of the film that we're all fighting to get when we finally got it? Um, Justice League. God, how did I forget that? Um, yes, I'm hearing a lot of things coming from the Flash movie, uh, which is the, apparently the Flashpoint story where the Flash goes back in time and changes everything and messes everything up, and we see all these alternate timeline versions. And apparently there's a giant crossover from the CW as well, which I never saw. Um, it's just a big mess. I can't follow it. And I'm kind of a genre comic sci-fi person, and I can't follow this, so I don't understand how normal, regular, like normies... Um, who are just watching the movies and don't sort of watch the TV shows or read the comics, how they're going to follow all this. I, I can't follow what's happening. But all I'm hearing now is that D, um, Warner Brothers has been bought by Discovery, and Discovery is basically wanting to clean DC up and basically relaunch all the main characters and make them the focus instead of having them be the background, which is what was happening to them, and they were going to bring out female versions of them. Like the next, the Flash movie was supposed to set up the new D She Yu being um, Supergirl, um, Batgirl, and Wonder Woman. That was what they were supposed to be doing. And I'm like, again, why do they have to kill off the men to have the women? Why can't the women have their own movies? Or uh, they fight together and they have like multiple villains for multiple heroes. I don't understand why it's one or the other. Um, so yeah, so now people are calling the DC universe the DC, not the DCU, but the She Yu, just like they were calling the. Marvel Cinematic University MCU because they were chaining it to a female. And I thought that was kind of sexist and stupid, but then I sort of started looking going, well, that is kind of what they're doing. Um, they're kind of replacing all of them. They're, they've they've been diminished in some way so that they're no longer um, the main sort of hero in their own story, and they're being replaced, or they're being outright replaced by female um, versions of the characters who either already exist or are being created for... Um, I guess Lady Thor existed, I don't know, and apparently you're not supposed to call her Lady Thor, but I don't know what to call her, I can't call her Thor, because then you don't know which Thor I'm talking about. Um, so that doesn't make any sense. Um, I only know one Thor, and there's Lady Thor, so what else am I going to call her? I don't know. But yeah, so I sort of was looking at that, and I'm like, really, they're killing Superman as a baby? Well, that's going to be charming on screen. They've already killed Bruce, on apparently. I'm like, okay. Um, I mean, I'm excited to see Michael... Um, Michael Keaton back as Batman, but how superfluous is that going to be? Is he just there for a couple of scenes just to get me into the cinema and then that's it, and then I just end up with dead bats? I don't, I don't know. I don't know what's happening anymore. What happened to my superheroes? I don't know. They're all dead. They're all dead and demasculated and neutered and... Um, I don't know about these new ladies. I mean, I love Wonder Woman. I always loved Supergirl. Not Supergirl. Um... Batgirl. Batwoman, she didn't grow on me. They replaced her too quickly, and then I didn't hear anything good about the new show. I haven't, still haven't watched it. I don't know if it's any good. Um, yeah. Supergirl, I mean, she was okay, but um, the actress was a bit of a 
not she wasn't very nice so that didn't give me a good feeling for it and then of course they had mommy dearest as the enemy so I mean it's, it's kind of they didn't give her like big end of the world stakes which is what we're always complaining about the new movies are all too big but Supergirl was too small so she didn't really earn like any real love I think because she didn't really do anything she just you know beat up Faye Dunaway um, that's about it so yeah I don't know I don't know what to think of the whole new um, I mean, and these are all rumours and suggestions we don't know what they're actually going to do it's going to take a year or two till they actually get some new films produced to see what direction they're taking the whole franchise in but um, it's kind of scary and curious and interesting and I guess we'll just have to sit back and watch but I'm going to go feel free to share, like, comment, subscribe let me know what you think of it all thanks, bye